Hey, y'all, and thank y'all for tuning in. Now, if this is your first time, welcome. Now, if you've been here before, welcome back. Y'all, I am truly excited. Can't you tell by the sound in my voice? That's because today we are going over the Pie Lovers Ultimate Vanilla Cream Pie, y'all. And on this channel, the food is always the star, y'all. So we're going to have a great day. Day, y'all in this video is for someone special y'all my mama y'all this is her recipe y'all with a few tweaks and twists y'all and i'm posting this video on her birthday y'all she is such a blessing she taught me everything i know y'all so we have these bread crumbs mixed up y'all mixed up well and these bread crumbs are graham cracker bread crumbs y'all we blended them up we sprayed the pan down. We have two sticks of butter in there, y'all. We gonna press, y'all. We gonna press firm, but not too firm to where it will cause gaps and breaks. But if it does, that's all right. Make sure you keep a little bit of your breadcrumbs to the side. That is what that is for. So you can phase in those breadcrumbs to build a strong foundation. And we want those edges, y'all. We are going for edges. Ain't nothing like some fine edges, y'all, on a pie. I tell you, and let me ask y'all, what is your go-to dessert? What dessert do you like to feed yourself or your family? I've asked it before, but y'all didn't reply. I really didn't get too many comments on that. So I want to ask you, what do you like to go to? Y'all, next phase is two blocks of cream cheese, y'all. We got the two blocks of cream cheese in there. We have this on a double boiler. That's what it's on. It's on the double boiler, y'all. And then we are pouring in three cups of of powdered sugar and three fourths cup of heavy cream y'all we getting that in and we have a quarter stick of butter we're gonna mix all that well and this again is on a double boiler so we have a pot of water boiling steaming and we have this bowl set on top of that we don't want to put too much water to where it overflows we just need enough water in that pot on high heat to where it can steam the bottom of the bowl then we're going to add in some clear vanilla extract, y'all. Now, you can add in traditional vanilla extract, but I am looking for maintenance of the color, y'all. I want that color to maintain. Yes, I put in cornstarch there, y'all. I put that cornstarch in as a thickening agent. I wanted no flour. Cornstarch works as a phenomenal thickening agent. It works better than flour, and it does not take away from the taste of the dish. That's what it's all about, y'all. Now we got two packs of vanilla pudding, y'all. We're going to phase in our milk, y'all. We're going to get that phased in, and we're going to whisk it up. Whisk it, whisk it, whisk it. And we also going to phase in some heavy cream, too. Y'all, the recipe doesn't call for heavy cream, but that is our secret agent, y'all. That is the secret agent. You add that touch of heavy cream and you mix it up well, then you will see the difference, y'all. It's going to be thick. Yeah, it's going to be real thick. It might discourage you, but keep on whisking. I know you got this. Trust me, keep whisking. If you have a mixer, mix it. And that is your vanilla cream pudding, y'all. And that looks so good. It came out phenomenal, y'all. And I'm telling you, this is so easy, so easy for you to make on your own. And now you got your pie crust out. Mm, mm, mm. And we're going to spread all that vanilla cream filling right there inside of it. And you see how that vanilla cream filling looks. This ain't the pudding mix. This is the two blocks of cream cheese with the heavy cream in there, the cornstarch. This is the vanilla cream pudding right there and if you want layer some wafers i have wafers layered underneath there and then i put a layer of the vanilla mix on top and then oh yeah y'all go ahead and put that cool whip on there mm, 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 mm. y'all we getting somewhere i'm telling you we are getting somewhere this is something anybody can do over the holidays y'all Anyone can do it any time of the year. And I want to thank my mama. Oh, mama, I love you. And I want to thank you for passing down this recipe, mama. 
And now we have it all across the world for anyone and everyone to try. Take a look at that there. I am saying from the bottom of my heart, y'all try this. Now, if you want to add some bananas in this, you can. Because this can be a banana cream pie, but it's not. It's a vanilla cream pie, y'all. I'm saying, whoo wee that look good now, and I want more of it. Y'all, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, y'all. Do that for us, y'all. And if you feel like it's something that we missed, let us know so we can add it to the playlist, y'all, because that's what it's all about, a beautiful, beautiful dessert for any and everybody to make y'all like comment and subscribe y'all and we'll see y'all on the next side and i want to say thank you to all the mothers of the world you do have some sons that do pay attention and do listen and treat you with respect Thank you, thank you, thank you. And to all the granddaddies and dads of the world who are like me, chefs, cooks, and just want to inspire in love, this is the way to do it.